Rainy. Yeah. It's like great right. soup and inside weather. Sounds like you need yeah. some whiskey. Yeah, because uh -oh. Casey has some drinks for us. What do or you that. So listen to this. This is pretty cool. Jamie and I were talking about Jay Rieger and Company, whiskey company. They had a hundred different kinds of alcohol back in 1887. Took a break during Prohibition, so it hasn't been around for a while. Mm -hmm. Rieger Hotel, same family. Andy Rieger, who's a younger guy, just revived this, and uh, they're producing whiskey, gin, vodka, really cool stuff right here in Kansas City. First thing we'll do in the whiskey making process is we're gonna mill the grain. Okay. So let's go, Jamie. I don't want to take my jacket off. It's cold in here. So this is the mash. This is already filled with water. This is our grain, and what we're gonna do now, uh, we have to turn on the steam to get the temperature right for the water before we add the grain. Nothing's happening. You will. You will. Don't worry. Ooh, here it is. So we had 99% corn and we have one little percent of uh, malted barley. What we're doing now, um, we're putting it over in that big stainless steel vessel and we're going to convert those starches into sugar. Cool. And that's the water, the steam. Yep, that's what's happening right there. So this is the stuff we don't want to use. This is not what's going to eventually go in a barrel. But this will become bourbon. I can smell it. So is the proof of this higher than actual bourbon? Or is like, does uh, that make sense? Right now, yeah, yeah. So what we have right now is about 140 proof. So yes, it's higher. I just have to taste uh, just I would taste it. It should start. It will, it'll taste like green apple at first, and then it'll. It's a compound called acetaldehyde, but uh, then it'll start to taste like grain. That sounds good for you. to the fermenter, four days, to the still, one day, and then to that tank, uh, for as long as it takes to get up enough that we can order some barrels. In. Watch out, Jamie. Woo! You have to make sure it doesn't fall, right? Yeah, that'd be bad. Can you push it up? Right there, that's, that's good. It reaches our fill height, and then it overflows into here. So you can't over, you really can't overflow. And then take it off in this one smooth motion, Perfect. Okay, and then now you can set it on here. We're gonna go through okay. here. I want to add the front and back labels. So sick. So wow. Lindsay said it goes in clear, yes, and That's it gets the color from the oak barrels. So they just barreled one for the Royals. It was like a Royals commemorative nice. with champagne. They used champagne to make it, and oh. we opened it, and one of the guys was freaking out. He's like, it's not even good. It's not going to be brown yet. Like, <laughs> <we're>, <laughs> we're like, That's it's cool. Okay. When is that going to be ready? Like, it takes a while, they, right? He said they're going to open it. I teased it on Twitter. He said they're going to open it next time they win. And I said, oh, it's their next year. And he's ah. like, it won't be brown enough yet. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, cool. so cool so stuff. Now so now you can bootleg. Yeah, right. <laughs> what are you doing next week? Next week, we're going to Lewisburg Cider Mill. Mm. Good stuff. Cider donuts are deadly. They are oh, good. Oh, gosh. But, Those uh, are good. Good stuff. And send us your requests. If you have a cool job, send it to us.